Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today I'm here with what I would consider to be probably the best performance enhancing mod available for Minecraft. Before I discovered this mod, I considered Optifine to be the best performance enhancing mod, and it does its job, but let me tell you, it really isn't even close. I mean, I'll just visualize for you just how impressive this mod is. And this is coming from someone that, you know, somewhat enjoys Optifine. So anyway, let's go ahead and get into the video and I'll prove for you just how good it is. All right, so I'm gonna be comparing identical scenes, both with and without the mod installed, playing on the exact same settings, which you can see here. To start things off, I will not have the Sodium mod installed, and as you can see, I'm sitting at about 200 FPS. And that's pretty good, but at the same time, I'm playing on a 1080, so that's pretty expected. But let's go ahead and switch to the Sodium mod. And as you can see, my FPS is now sitting at above 700. Just by installing one mod, my FPS FPS went up by over 500. That's just absurd, honestly. Here's another clip, and you know, it's more of the same. Here I've gone from 250 FPS to 650. Truly, I was shocked when I figured out this mod works this well, because most performance enhancing mods I've checked in the past, it's usually around a 10% gain, not 350%. Now, if there's one thing I would nitpick from this mod, it's the fact that it is a fabric mod and not made for Forge. But honestly, this isn't even much of an issue anymore, considering that more mods are being created for fabric. There's honestly a pretty good list of them for it now. And you know, that doesn't really matter in the end of the day. A lot of people aren't really looking looking to actually play with mods and just want to increase their FPS, and this is the perfect way to do it, honestly. Really, the only way you could potentially get a bigger FPS gain than installing this mod would be just buying a new computer. Here's a comparison from the end, and honestly, at this point, it just gets even more out of hand. As you can see, when I don't have Sodium installed, I have a lousy 450 FPS, but once I do get it installed, I'm sitting at a very manageable 1100. At this point, my graphics card was actually making a high-pitched sound, so, you know, it was working. For this next comparison, I'll even throw an Optifine, just to show how much of a difference this mod makes. As usual, I'll start with vanilla, and you can see I'm sitting at around 220 FPS. Now I'll switch over to Optifine, and the FPS is sitting around 290, which is a pretty good gain. But now we'll go ahead and switch over to Sodium, and what do you know, we're at 700 FPS. And as if enhancing your FPS wasn't enough, this mod goes ahead and actually improves the visuals a little bit. It's nothing significant, but it is noticeable. In this first example, you can see that biome blending has been improved to be pretty much seamless. And it already looks good in vanilla, to be honest, but this makes it look even better. In this next example, however, the improvements are a little more obvious. Without the mod, you can see that each block has its own light level, which looks a little strange and unnatural. Once we have the mod installed, though, you can see everything is just nice and smooth. In situations like this, the difference is night and day. Kind of like the FPS. Alright, that's the end of this video, and if you guys decide to try this mod, go ahead and let me know just how much it helped your game's performance. Obviously, different computers are going to get different levels of improvement, so I'd love to know what you guys get. And anyways, if you guys enjoyed this video, be sure to leave a like, comment, and subscribe, and until next time, thanks for watching.